guys, so it's currently two o'clock and I have been super busy all morning. I have been editing and vlogging and ugh, it's just a lot. So <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm a little tired, but currently I'm in a rush because it is the day before Christmas Eve and I haven't finished Brandon's stocking stuffers. So I have to go and do that. But um, also, while we speak, my new main channel video is being uploaded right this second. So, woohoo! And as always, those links are down below. So, if you guys want to go see them, go check them out. But for now, we're on our way to the post office. Sorry, the light's really bright. We're going to be on our way to the post office, and then we have to go run to my mom's this evening. And so, you guys are just going to be hanging out with me, no Brandon today, which is weird because we've been with him like the last five days in the vlog. So, it's just me today, guys, and we're going to be on our way to the post office now. Hey guys, so back in the car now, um, development, <laughs> went all the way into the post office and they're closed. So I couldn't get my stamps, Ugh. but I did make this a productive stop. I ran into the Dollar Tree and got boyfriend some little goodies to stick in his stocking, but I still need to get a couple more and so I'm going to go to Barnes & Noble next, which I'm not excited about. Traffic is nuts. I don't know why I waited last minute to do anything. Ugh, my bad. But I'm on my way there now, as long as I can get there. <laughs> and so yeah, that's what's going on. Ooh. Doo -doo -doo. There. <laughs> it's so funny guys, cause Christmas time, everyone's supposed to be cheery and happy and nice. And I feel like people get so rude and cranky around this time of year. And I hate that. Cause you know, it's Christmas, like, <laughs> I don't know, maybe that's just me, but I, I would think that you would want to be nice to like everyone you meet, because you know everyone's shopping for Christmas, and even if they're not, who cares? But I was in the Dollar Tree, and this woman complained about this guy asking for money for the bus, and I'm just sitting there going, you know, would it hurt you to let him just stand there and ask for money for the bus? Like, he's not hurting anyone. He's just asking for change. Guy needs a ride. Like, come on, man. But she was just so rude about it. And honestly, I think it would have been easier and kinder just to give him 50 cents for the bus. Like, maybe that's just me. But holiday attitude lately has just been going downhill, I think. And that needs to change. I don't feel the merriness. Ah, dang it. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, I'm almost to the bookstore, and then I think I want some Starbucks, and we're going to go down to Mom's so I can wrap the rest of these stockings. <laughs> hey, guys. So, I just got to the Birds and Noble, and actually, it wasn't too crazy. When I first got there, the line was, like, wrapping out the door, and I was freaking the heck out, but it took me so long to shop. The line went down, and I got done in and out really quickly, so it wasn't not that bad. Now, I'm sitting out. Side Best Buy and actually the parking lots are getting kind of empty so hopefully everyone's running home before the 5 o'clock traffic hits because it's only 3.30 now but I'm going to run into Best Buy and try and see if I can find a movie or two for babes and then I think I'm done with him for his stocking because we weren't really going to get each other big big presents this year we we're just doing stocking so while I was at Barnes & Noble I picked up two books that my mom ordered for him and then I got him this cool little like table game and it's called like intense scrabble or something it just seems like something you would like and I got him this stupid pen that he wanted and it's it's completely flat so you can put it inside of a book and um, I just thought it was kind of cool I thought he might like it because he's picked it up before so for stocking stuffers I think he's almost done but I am gonna run in and see if I can get him a movie because he loves that <laughs> so I'll check back with you guys blah, blah, in a little hey guys, bit <laughs> I'm at my mom's now and I'm pestering Garen because he's on the phone with my mother <laughs> But look who's here! It's Momo and Snooker Doodle! Hi, Doodle Doo! She said if you don't tell her where you want to go, you're not getting paid. If you made Chick fil A. Oh, Chick fil A sucks. <gasps> Did you hear that, guys? He said Chick fil A sucks. <laughs> oh my god. Huh? Hi guys, just checking in. We have. Shut up, Darren! <laughs> I'm vlogging! <laughs> Anyway, um, I just finished wrapping Brandon's stocking stuffers with mom. Say hi, mom. Hi, mom. We went to go eat and I ate too much panda. I feel pregos right now. I'm so full. It's not cool. But yeah, do you guys want to see our tree? 
and then we have all the presents under there. Pretty fun. So I'm gonna hang out here for a little bit and then probably go home because I'm super tired. And so that's what's going on, guys. So we're gonna be doing just this for a little bit. <laughs> Hi guys, I am currently at home now. Um, me and my mom just watched a little bit of a show called Scandal and then I drove all the way here because I was really tired. And it's currently nine o'clock at night and boyfriend has decided he's hungry. <laughs> so we're gonna go out to get something to eat. Fat kid problems. Wait, dude, wait. Fat kid problems. <laughs> right. So I need to find my phone. Uh -oh. Do you guys do this? Do you put your phone down and you can't find it? I do it all the time. It's severely a problem. Love it. Shit, you do. Aw, oh, fuck. Woman. <laughs> so, can you turn you that little light on? Turn the little light on. Why don't you turn the big one on? We don't need to leave the big one on. Well, you could have turned the big one on a while. <laughs> do I need to bring anything? Do I need to bring my wallet? No. This is the face he gives me all the time. <laughs> I honestly don't think he really likes me very much. I think he just keeps me around for the humor. I better humor myself. <gasps> that was rude. Brandon, that was rude. On the vlog. I keep you around for bus slaps. <laughs> that was now, rude. Zip up your coat. Hold up the camera. It's like a hallway of death. It is. Watch well, this down the hallway with it. It's creepy. I know. Huh? I said I know. You got sick? No, I did already. Uh -oh. and then somebody decided to uh, kick the mud off their shoes for the past like 10 days in the same freaking spot. <gasps> My hair is fabulous today. It's fabulous. Fabulous. Oh. Took a nap and it just looks, it looks it's glorious. Like it looks just fucking awesome. Are you done? Eskimo Tori. <laughs> oh no. It's cold out here. What would you do for a Klondike bar? What do they always say? For what? For what would you do? Babe, <laughs> for what would you do for a Klondike bar? That's the point. It's, it's whatever answer you would come up with. I can't even see you. That's the whole point of the commercial. Let me in. <laughs> okay guys, so as you can tell, I'm in my bathroom and actually I'm going to end my vlog here. I have decided to take a bath and kind of relax the rest of the evening and then call it quits. I'm going to go to bed because tomorrow I have work and a pretty long day ahead of me. So that's it for today's video guys and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>